What's up, world? This your boy, your one and only Money Moves with your boy, Mim 2.0. On this YouTube channel, every day we strive for financial excellence so you guys live a better and prosperous, financially free tomorrow. As you guys know, on this YouTube channel, we talk a lot about a multitude of topics from vlogs, current events, your city to my city, credit, how to use debt as leverage, how to acquire different types of loans without using traditional banks, how to acquire real estate the non-traditional way, um, money and relationships. As you guys know, we mainly talk about relationships on this YouTube channel because relationships can make and break you. And every man knows that who he chooses to have an intimate sexual relationship with will have a high impact on his soon-to-be financial status. So guys, the topic of today's video, we're going to be talking about how um, modern black women are more lonely than ever. So, guys, before we get into this video, like I said, man, I want to thank you guys, man, who've been rocking with me, man, since day one. You guys been with me since day for since day one. We've been out here grinding. We've been sharing knowledge with each other from guys from all over the world. I got people um, who subscribe and who's in this network who is from United Kingdom, Canada, you know what I'm saying, all different types of cities in the United States and other countries as well. So, guys, man, let's get up on it. And, and for all you guys who haven't subscribed yet, if you rock it with my video, hit the subscribe button. So let's get straight into the topic. So, loneliness. Loneliness is a, it's, it's a, a human emotion, you know, where you get lonely, you get bored, you know. But we're going to be talking about how why modern black women modern black women are more lonely than ever so you know most black women when they're young they have they have abundance of men who is venting to get in their genes and venting to be in relationships with them and venting to be friends and lifetime partners and stuff. And most nine times out of 10, if that black woman did get with that guy and she was supposed to be with him for the rest of her life, she's not going to be with him. And she's going to do this. She's going to do this year in and year out. And then she's going to reach her age. You know what I'm saying? Where you're seeing a lot of these modern black women, you know what I'm saying? They, she's going to reach the age of 30 to 40 to 50 years old. And she's going to be the same type of chick that uh, all these other black women are. They're going to be like, where are all the good men at? I'm, I I want a companion. I do want to get married. I want children. You know what I'm saying? And you see where most most black women messed up at is that they had children. They had children out of wedlock. They had children early in their 20s with the guy that they were supposed to be with. They had children in their early 20s with the guy they were supposed to be with and it ended up not having, having children, but leaving this guy, putting them on child support and stuff. Now, this guy doesn't want to have nothing to do with you. Uh, so however many baby daddies you got, most of nine times out of ten, after you do them as dirty as you did them, they don't want to have nothing to do with you. And now they're by women's, a lot of women, they biological clock start running. You know what I'm saying? You had these kids, you know what I'm saying? You got these bills, you know, you got to get, you, you can't just get a one bedroom apartment. You can't just get a one bedroom house. You got to get a two, three, four bedroom house to acquire your family. You know what I'm saying? So most of these black women put it upon themselves. They put it upon themselves to, you know what I'm saying, do the man and woman role, raise the kids, you know what I'm saying, try to be the father and the mother, which is extremely difficult. And these women become, they start aging. You know what I'm saying? A lot of these women start aging and getting old. They start getting old very fast. You know what I'm saying? From all the stress, all the hard work. All the, you know what I'm saying? Most of them not working hard, but they get stressed out. All this stress and stuff is start wearing on their body, you know. Then, you know, a lot of these girls going to get BBLs, you know what I'm saying? Their breasts start saggy, you know what I'm saying? And they get lonely. These women, modern women are sitting back lonely. And most of them do not. Most of them got a, out of a dog. They got kids who is about to get up out the house. 
But some of these modern women, they don't even want to, they don't even want to promote college or getting out the house to the kids because they don't want to be lonely. You know what I'm saying? They want, they need company. They they need company, but nobody is, all the guys are trying to get with the young, fruitful, feminine, beautiful women. You know what I'm saying? You see a lot of these, uh, a lot of these older black women and miss their opportunities to find a man, be with a man, build that man up, build that man up, be supportive of that man. So you will have something to live off for the rest of your life. That man will build a foundation for you to live off for the rest of your life. See, most black women, they chose that government route. They chose that. Um, they listen to other older black women. They listen to other older black women. You know, who didn't know no much more than they knew. Older black women lead young black women down a hole of trauma and loneliness and non-success. You guys are not, not just because you look successful, a lot of you women are not as successful as you think you are. You know what I'm saying? Um, and what happens is, is these women become bitter and angry. They, you know what I'm saying? Black women are already angry, you know what I'm saying? Masculine most of the time. But they become bitter and angry, and and you know nobody wants to. And 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 the more and the more that life goes on, these women start to realize that maybe Chad, Brad, Enrique, Julio, John, uh, Ken, uh, Jackie Chan ain't coming. Ain't nobody coming to lay with you. Nobody's coming to lay beside you and watch movies with you and go to the park and, you know what I'm saying, uh, go fishing and spend their lifetime. You, a lot of black women have ruined their opportunities to find a good man, keep a good man, build that man up to greatness. And now they're running around like chickens with their head cut off. So, guys, I'm just letting you know, you guys are winning more than what you think you are. So, guys, man, I'm going to cut this video short, man. Leave some comments below. Let me know what you guys think on the topic today. Um, this your boy, you want it only money moves with your boy, Mill 2.0, reporting live from undisclosed location in the city of New York. Over and out.